Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for June 18th of 2024 is titled Gigantic Jets Over Himalayan Mountains. So what do we see here? Well, here looking out over the Himalayas, we see gigantic jets of lightning. Now, typically we're used to lightning that works its way either between clouds, which we call cloud to cloud lightning, which that is between different clouds or cloud to ground lightning, the lightning, the strikes that we're really used to seeing here on Earth. However, these unusual lightning strikes are relatively newly discovered, in fact, only this century, and they are lightning that actually works its way upward. So from the thunderstorms off there in the distance up into Earth's ionosphere, it's very upper parts of its atmosphere. Now, in each case, the lightning is what's happening is it's equalizing electrical charges. So you get a buildup of electrical charge. And that means that there it becomes an electrical force between positive and negative charges. And the charges want to neutralize, they want to balance to zero. Now, the electromagnetic force is much stronger than perhaps the gravitational force with which you might be more familiar. The electric force and that's why we don't have very strong concentrations of electrical charges, positive charges or negative charges, they quickly neutralize to balance to zero. So that's what happens here. And when that electromagnetic force equalizes, we get those lightning strikes. That's the transport of that electrical energy to uh, something to sort of ground it out and to equalize those charges. Now up in the top, we see that reddish color and that actually resembles the red sprites that we've looked at in the past. That's a very unusual type of lightning and relatively rare type in Earth's upper atmosphere that has only been studied for the last few decades. So we're really still trying to get an understanding of how these different mechanisms work. So what are we learning about? We're trying to learn about how these unusual forms of lightning affect our atmosphere, how they form and what that tells us about our own atmosphere. Now you might wonder, does lightning occur elsewhere in our solar system? And the answer is yes, it does. We have detected lightning on other planets as well. In fact, spacecraft have seen lightning on both Jupiter and Saturn. Now, how about more Earth like planets? We have Mars and Venus. Well, they both have an atmosphere. Do they have lightning? And the answer right there is no, at least currently. We have tried to detect lightning in both atmospheres and have been unsuccessful. And those same instruments are able to detect lightning here on Earth. So we have to conclude that lightning either is extremely rare on these planets or does not occur at all. Now Mars does have evidence of lightning in the past, kind of like it has evidence of water on its surface in the past. There are signs of lightning strikes on the ground on Mars. But in terms of current lightning currently occurring, it is not something we have been able to detect. But we do know of lightning currently on Earth as well as Jupiter and Saturn within our own solar system. So that was our picture of the day for June 18th of 2024. It was titled Gigantic Jets Over Himalayan Mountains. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Dragon Fight. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.